Don't be afraid of enemies who attack you. Be afraid of the friends who flatter you. You can measure the size of a person by what makes him or her angry. You can conquer almost any fear if you will only make up your mind to do so, for remember, fear doesn't exist anywhere except in the mind. Talk to someone about themselves and they'll listen for hours. Pay less attention to what men say. Just watch what they do. Every man I meet is my superior in some way. In that, I learn of him. Three-fourths of the people you will meet are hungering for sympathy. Give it to them and they will love you. Most of the important things in the world have been accomplished by people who have kept on trying when there seemed to be no hope at all. Our fatigue is often caused not by work, but by worry, frustration and resentment. Criticisms are like homing pigeons. They always return home. Happiness doesn't depend on outward conditions. It depends on inner conditions. The expression a woman wears on her face is far more important than the clothes she wears on her back. When we hate our enemies, we are giving them power over us. Power over our sleep, our appetites, our blood pressure, our health and our happiness. The rare individual who unselfishly tries to serve others has an enormous advantage. Remember, today is the tomorrow you worried about yesterday. When dealing with people, remember you are not dealing with creatures of logic, but with creatures bristling with prejudice and motivated by pride and vanity. Any fool can criticize, complain and condemn, and most fools do, but it takes character and self-control to be understanding and forgiving. Our thoughts make us what we are. Develop success from failures. Discouragement and failure are two of the surest stepping stones to success. Even God doesn't propose to judge a man till his last days. Why should you and I? If you are not in the process of becoming the person you want to be, you are automatically engaged in becoming the person you don't want to be. Knowledge isn't power until it is applied. The successful man will profit from his mistakes and try again in a different way. All men have fears, but the brave put down their fears and go forward, sometimes to death, but always to victory. Be more concerned with your character than with your reputation, for your character is what you are, while your reputation is merely what others think you are. If you want to keep happiness, you have to share it. I've come to the conclusion that there is only one way under high heaven to get the best of an argument, and that is to avoid it. Success is getting what you want. Happiness is wanting what you get. We're all dreaming of some magical rose garden over the horizon instead of enjoying the roses blooming outside our windows today. Every successful person loves the game, the chance to prove his worth, to excel, to win. Flaming enthusiasm backed up by horse sense and persistence is the quality that most frequently makes for success.
The only way I can get you to do anything is by giving you what you want. Remember a name and call it easily, and you have paid a subtle and very effective compliment. One reason why birds and horses are not unhappy is because they are not trying to impress other birds and horses. Only knowledge that is used sticks in your mind. Arouse in the other person an eager want. He who can do this has the whole world with him. Ask questions instead of giving orders. Success in dealing with people depends on a sympathetic grasp of the other person's viewpoint. The average person is more interested in her own name than in all the other names on earth put together. Actions speak louder than words. A smile says, I like you, I am glad to see you. People are more likely to accept an order if they had a part in the decision that caused the order to be issued. Criticism is dangerous because it wounds a person's pride, hurts his sense of importance and arouses resentment. Happiness doesn't depend on any external conditions, it is governed by our mental attitude. You cannot teach a man anything, you can only help him to find it within himself. If you want to gather honey, don't kick over the beehive. Inaction breeds doubt and fear. Action breeds confidence and courage. If you want to conquer fear, do not sit home and think about it. Go out and get busy. Take a chance. All life is a chance. The man who goes furthest is generally the one who is willing to do and dare. People rarely succeed unless they have fun in what they are doing. If you can't sleep, then get up and do something instead of lying there and worrying. It's the worry that gets you, not the loss of sleep. Act as if you were already happy and that will tend to make you happy. For better or worse, you must play your own instrument in the orchestra of life. The person who seeks all their applause from outside has their happiness in another's keeping. Winning friends begins with friendliness. By fighting you never get enough, but by yielding you get more than you expected. Do the hard jobs first, the easy jobs will take care of themselves. Instead of worrying about what people say of you, why not spend time trying to accomplish something they will admire? Fear not those who argue, but those who dodge. Feeling sorry for yourself and your present condition is not only a waste of energy, but the worst habit you could possibly have. There are always three speeches for every one you actually gave, the one you practiced, the one you gave, and the one you wish you gave. When fate hands you a lemon, make lemonade. Most of us have far more courage than we ever dreamed possible. Try honestly to see things from the other person's point of view. Do the thing you fear to do and keep on doing it. That is the quickest and surest way ever yet discovered to conquer fear.
If only the people who worry about their liabilities would think about the riches they do possess, they would stop worrying.